Yo, what's good, boys and girls? Um, dinos and dinoettes. Um, like, this video is about. Sorry for yawning. I need to take this video seriously. So, basically, what I gotta say is, uh, I'm gonna be telling you uh, about trick tips and tricks. I, I was gonna say 10 tips and tricks. Let's try doing 10 tips and tricks, but let's see. Um, this is some of it's inspired by Six Ghosts. I watched one part of it. It was I'll show you in a bit what it was one of the tips and tricks that it was that he said in one of his videos but shout out to him and um even though he has 10k subscribers he doesn't really need a shout out but yeah I just wanna you know respect him and give him a shout out anyways um let's get to the point one one tip and trick that I have that I always use is change your sense no matter what you're doing, change it. So like now I'm at 1.8, 0.18 I mean, right? I'm at 0.18. If I'm losing, right, to 1v1, I'm I'm bound to like just change it to like 0.15. I always change it. So if it's the lowest, which is 0.15, that'll go to 0.12 sometimes, which is more lo the lowest, you know what I'm saying? The, and then maybe like 0 0.20, 0 0.20. Wait, let me fix it. 0.20. Always do that. Always do that. You know what I'm saying? Like, try to change it. Your aim might be might be bad at that time, but once you keep moving, wanting that same person, your aim is gonna get better no matter what. You know, it's, it's gonna be hard. I'm telling you, it's gonna be hard. Just change it. Don't stay stay at the same sense. Don't stay with the same sense. You know what I'm saying? Always challenge yourself to use different senses. You know what I'm saying? Anyways, I'm going to change it back to what I was on. I think it was 0.18, right? Okay. And then, always, like, if you if you have nobody to, like, when I was, when I had my main account, I never had friends. Uh, sorry for the background. My sisters are watching cartoons. But when I was, when I had my VIP, I never had anybody to 1v1 or play with. Or I used to use my friend's VIP and he wasn't online. Always... Or if you have you have friends and they're ass at the game, you just don't want to one v one them, and you just want to practice your aim. You could do this. You could just shoot one, two. You know, like practice your aim. I'm using silencer, so it's a little bit delayed, but don't worry. You know what I'm saying? Just practice it. Alright, just go as fast as you can. And always for me, I use silencer. So if you wanna last longer in a 1v1 always use silencer i know it's delayed as heck it's so delayed but always use silencer it's it's good it's actually good you know how many times i've streamed and i've 1v1 kids i've done officials or in a video i've done an official and i killed that certain person that i was 1v1 with and i had one bullet left i liked three bullets because of my aim was ass but since i had more bullets than him yeah three bullets so I had more bullets than I was able to last longer and I was able to win. Don't worry. Listen, you'll get used to it, okay? Another one. Oh, and also use DB. Shotgun is also good. I use shotgun. But if you're bad with shotgun at that time and you're delayed as heck and, and you have high ping, use DB. DB shoots faster than the SG. SG is hard, like... As she has like what five five four bullets something like that in it. Always use DB if your ping is high. That's one thing I prefer. Use DB and use ref if your ping is also high. Don't use any delayed guns when your ping is high. Use guns that are never delayed. If you don't have um if you don't have like high ping, I don't have high ping, but I usually get twenty to thirty ping. I know you guys are gonna be like, oh my gosh, you're you should be the best player, bro. You have like twenty ping, bro. Just always use, like, you know, if you have, like, high ping, use, don't, don't use delayed guns. That's what I'm saying. Use guns that are not delayed. Don't use guns that are delayed. And, yeah, just use silencer. If you don't have high ping, use silencer. If you're, just try using silencer. I know most the hood pros are like, let me use, let me use, let me dupe, um, rev. No, just try to use silencer, bro. It's, it's worth it. It's worth it. At the end, when you, when you're skillful at that gun, when you master that gun, you're going to see. You're actually going to see. I promise you. Okay? I use DB sometimes because it actually hits the shots. I just need to aim correctly with it. And if I aim correctly with it, I, you know, I actually get a streak. 
a winning streak with Woven once. But sometimes when my aim's ass with D DB, I use SG. So I switch up the guns frequently. And when I'm in a tight spot and I'm raiding, I don't go straight to silence. So I switch up the gun to, like, let's say, pistol. Even though pistol's the worst gun in the game. That DMAG so-called said. But don't worry about that. Just use whatever gun you could use. You know what I'm saying? Just switch up the guns. Switch it up. Don't stay stuck on Nim use Rev and DB. Just switch it up. Um, is that four? Are we on four or three? Don't matter. I'm just gonna give you some other tips and tricks. How about that? Um, what else am I thinking of? There's this thing that I did when I was um, when I used to stream like earlier, earlier this year. I used to use wait target target PNG. Search up par target PNG. It's like if you use if you search up target PNG, um, it will be transparent. Wait. It'll, it'll be transparent. So like, which one did I use? I use this one. If you have a friend, this is this one's transparent. If you have a friend that plays the hood and he has a group, and you're close with him, tell him like, bro, can you change your group logo to let's say this and give him the picture towards it? Maybe he'll do it. Maybe he'll not. He, he won't do it. Why am I saying maybe he'll not? My grammar. I'm sorry. Maybe he won't. Maybe he would. So I'm just saying, if and it'll help your aim. It won't help your aim, but it'll help it, like, it'll improve your aim a little bit more. That's all I got to say about that. But, what else? What else? I'm thinking, I'm thinking. I know there's, uh, okay, yeah, there's one part for 1v1 that I have in mind. So, when you're close, let's say, okay, let's say this is, this is, this wall right here. Let's just say this wall is a person, right? Okay, limit join, but it doesn't matter. I mean, able join. But listen, it doesn't matter if he's... Okay, so if he's right here, right? Don't try going back. Okay? Don't go back. If you're not a good a good player with long distance, don't, bro. It's not worth it. Always go close range. Always go close range. You know what I'm saying? Always. Always try to. Always try to go close range. Because once you go close range, that dude's gonna, that guy's going to be scared. You know how many times I thought this kid was locking, but how many times I was one v one this dude, and I was one v one him, and I felt I was scared. I was scared. I was like scared so much because he was good, and I went so close. I went so close up to him, right? I was like right here. He was like let's say yeah, right there, and I kept jumping, and he got and I just flicked him right there. I always did that, and he got mad. He almost stopped me, but he got mad. So. They oh people get scared when you get too close up to them. They're thinking, oh shit, he's gonna pop one pop me. When you're long distance, you're not afraid because you have let's say you have rev. Let me shoot this kid. Let me headshot him. You know what I'm saying? Let me do my little hacky hacks, even though you're not gonna hack. You know, I'm just saying. But most people they feel more in their comfort zone when they're long distanced. Am I recording? Okay, I am. Okay. More they they feel more. Comf comforting when they're in long distance, but when you go close up to them, they get so nervous. Most kids won't get nervous, but majority of the hoodians will. So you like flick them or something like that. I don't know how to flick or anything, but just just try, just try that. I'm telling you, they won't say it in chat. They won't try to m make you um, look like you have some ter type of fear against them, like you're making them scared. But j just I'm just saying, I tried it before. Like, I, I made a video about it with, like, Spaz. Every time, this is one. This is what he does. He goes back. He keeps going long distance because he's good with long distance. People were rev. They're not good with long, with, like, short distance. They're good with long distance because they could just two-tap you, headshot you with rev. You know what I'm saying? Silencer, it's easier. You know what I'm saying? You could just go up close, kill him right there. People were rev. They like going back because they could just two tap you, and with no worries, they could just two tap you or just two two body shot you right there. You know what I'm saying? That's that's basically it. Um, another tip that I have. Uh, what is the other tip? Hmm. I'm looking. I'm. I'm. So, I'm. I'm not looking. I'm seeing. What? What am I saying? I'm seeing. I'm sorry, guys. My grammar is like it's like a kindergartner. I'm thinking. Um, give me a second. I'm, I'm actually, wait. 
Um, I'm still thinking. Okay. Always when you want one somebody, right? First, don't start trying to one v one somebody. Like, okay, let's say, let's say we're just doing like um, just one v ones on the spot. You know what I'm saying? Um, or somebody's streaming and there's just random one v ones, and you're like, okay, let me one v one this kid because he killed the streamer. Just watch how he plays. If he's just playing, if if this person's going this way, and the guy's going this way. Oh no, if this dude is just going this way, right? He's going to the right. And you're also going on your left, which is his right. You want to go the opposite way because you just try to trick him. Go back. And then right there and kill him. Right there. And that's it. And you two, two tap him and he's dead. Always learn the person's technique when you're about to move with them. Before you move one that person, learn their technique. And let's say um, you're going to watch... You're gonna one v one a YouTuber. Learn their technique before you one v one them. You know what I'm saying? I I don't do that. I should be doing that. I should listen to my own tips and tricks. I don't do that at all. I'm just bullshitting. But I'm gonna try doing that. Once I start one v one other people, I'm gonna like learn their you know strategies that they use and then use it against them. What else? Don't use animations, bro. Don't use animations. If you use animations, I know two people that use animations. If Jeff is watching this and IC is watching this, not IC and Chulo, somebody else, another IC. If he's watching this, bro, why do you guys lay? You guys lay so much. It's annoying. Like I don't know. I don't know if you like one v one the hood stars and you could do that. But every time I watch Jeff's videos, he's always using lay to one v one. Like, he will lay... I don't know how to do it. Or what's he doing? I'm making a video. If... If if I'm like... I won't be one I see once. Not Revenge Jeff. But I think they play like the same... They play the same, kind of. And they will... He will lay... Like, look. Lay. Lay and then... Start attacking. So yeah, and that that's basically it. And um, I'm thinking of something else. I'm thinking of something else. But okay, this is this is one thing. If you're a the hood pro, or you started playing the game, this is not this has nothing to do with tips and tricks. Maybe, maybe. But always, always, wait, let me carry it, even though I have money, I'm just let me get some. Alright, always get lettuce. If you don't know where the lettuce is, I'm going to show you right now. Always get lettuce. I'm telling you, get lettuce. Alright, so I'm going to show you where the lettuce is, and then I'll tell you some other tips and tricks. But always get, like, it helps you with food and to get skinny. Because I don't know how many times... I one with one kids and they're so fat and then they're like, bro, aim lock and they're fat as fuck. Like, bro, eat lettuce, eat lettuce. Last time, eat lettuce. It's right here. You could dupe it. Okay, let me show you. Press it and then click on it again and then just crouch right, clicking it one more time and that's it. Let me get rid of it because I'm not trying to get skinny. And then that's. One more thing. I was thinking of one more thing. I had, I had in my head. I had in my head. I had in my head. Don't spam. Don't spam. Don't spam, bro. If, like, I don't mind you spamming. Don't spam. Like, I don't mind. What am I saying? I don't mind you spamming, bro. I'm not even, I'm not even the, the hood owner. What am I saying? I'm acting like I own you guys. But anyways, don't spam. Just don't spam. Like, if you're low as heck, and the other dude is low. He has more chance. Stop! I'm making a video. You're being annoying. I'm, I'm jigging on Adam, bro. He's being annoying. Oh my god, don't worry about him. Um.
Anyways. Okay, now he's, okay, I guess he's gonna stop now. But anyways, let's get to the point. I'm sorry for repeating myself. If you are loving one somebody, don't spam. Just don't spam while you're low and that other person's like yellow and you're red. If you're red, if your health is red and he's yellow and his health is yellow, don't try spamming him. You might win, but you're still gonna lose. Regardless, you're gonna lose. If he has like a rev on him, he's gonna either, and you're low, he's gonna one tap you. Stop. Stop, dude. Just stop. Stop, do that or dude. Just stop. Don't don't try spamming. It might work, like another Xavier Wild. It might work when you spam him, but just don't, don't. It's n like for me, it doesn't work at all. When I see other people one v one, and they try spamming, I like earlier today there was this dude, um, I think it was what's his name? I forgot his name. Cam Cammy. He was one v one, and he got clapped so hard because he was trying to spam. Don't try spamming. You're going to die regardless. You you might get some some like um some hits on some hits on the opponent that you're moving one, but it doesn't matter. You're you're going to walk you're going to start walking slow. You're wasting your time spamming. Most of the shots are not even going to hit. Maybe, maybe not, but I'm just saying don't just don't spam. It's not worth it. By the time by the time you finish spamming, the dude the dude already has his DB reloaded and he's going to one pump you. So just don't, all right? One more thing. Um, mm. There's one thing, bro. There's one thing. Guys, I want you to know. I want you to know this. This is one good trick. They might patch just or something. Sorry for the background again, but look. Let me show you. View all items. Wait. Avatar bundles, right? Body parts. All body parts. Wait, heads. No, wait, not heads. All body parts, bundles. All right, let's see. Let's see where it is. This one. This one. Bro, this head right here. I've seen so many people wear this head. They don't know this. I don't think they know this, but I do. And I want to tell you guys this. I hope this video gets like, I might make a separate video about this, but I'm going to tell you guys this. It makes, like, it's hard to see when somebody is low. When they're low, it's hard to see if they're low or not. It's hard to see if they're yellow turning to red. You know what I'm saying? Like, their health. It's so hard because I've wanted to be one kids and I thought they were, like, dead. Like, yeah, I thought they were dead by my by me killing them. And they actually, they were actually, like... No, I thought they were still alive, but they were actually red. And I was so close to killing them, and I stopped killing them because I thought they were hacking. Bro, this head is so good. You don't even need you don't even need the mask to like cover cover your No. It might cover your user. I think it might cover your user as well. It, it might from far distance, like if if the person's like, let's say right here, and I'm right here, I can't see his name. Like yeah, let's say right here, I can't. See his name. I gotta get closer. So also hide your name a little bit, a little bit, and it doesn't show the person when you're shooting them, like your health. But yeah, that's that's basically it. Um, sorry for my my um, grammar, my speech impediments. I'm really sorry. Like I have this like nasty ass accent. I'm sorry, guys. But um, I'm gonna end this video here. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to like and subscribe. I made like a whole, what is it, <laughs> 19 minute video, maybe 20 minute video about explaining everything. If I miss something, please tell me so I can make a part two. And I appreciate it. Peace out, guys. Make, keep being unique. Keep being blessed. And peace. Bye.